if you could just um, explain a little bit about the charitable insured annuity. I didn't quite understand the okay, concept so, of that. Is um, that there's, two, there's basically two components to it. The, the annuities in Canada for, for people, especially for people over 65, <clears throat> have very, very favorable tax treatment. And uh, in the current marketplace, depending on your age, somewhere between 70 and 90% of the cash flow that you receive is not taxable. So by itself, annuities can be an interesting way of dealing with a reduction in income. Now, in a charitable insured annuity, what you're doing is taking the insurance portion of the annuity, which guarantees upon death that you would get your money back if you died one day later or 20 years later, and you're saying, okay, well, if I'm going to give money away to a charity anyway, um, am I better off to wait until I died and let them take it out of my estate, or am I better to just give them this insurance, which is gonna do exactly the same thing, and then the government will give me a tax credit every year while I can spend it. So that was the distinction we did for the case study, was to say, well, it, it's a decision, you don't have to do that, but you could do that if the issue was you were trying to increase the cash flow on your fixed income investments.